Hello guys, it's Wednesday. Alright, this video is going to be ultimately very short, um, just cause I got a lot to do today and I don't really have time to make a long, deep, involved video. But, um, I will cover a couple of things, so, yeah. First is NaNoWriMo, um, as most of the exotic tofu gang already know. I, um, I completed my novel. Yeah, I'm officially a novelist because I have written a novel. Oh my gosh, it, 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 it like, I hit 50,000 words on the Friday, the last Friday of the month, the day after Thanksgiving, and it was just, like, the most exciting thing ever. It, I didn't even know what to do. I, I got done, and then I pretty much just walked up to my mom's work, because she works at a restaurant, and, like, had a huge, just, lunch stuff in my face. I had, like... What did I end up having? I don't know. But I ended up getting myself pie afterwards because I had just written a novel and I deserved it. Um, I know you guys really want to read it. Um, lots of people kind of do. Uh, just because it's 50,000 words doesn't mean that it's very good. There are parts, the thinking back now, I definitely do like. Um, then again, there was just a lot of stuff that, um, yeah. Like, writing my novel, there were times when I was just kind of scatterbrained and... Consequently, I would just kind of make my character scatterbrain too. So, it really needs to, like, with go, so, or go through some editing for <clears throat> a very long time. And then maybe I will let you guys read some of it. However, for those of you who know anything about NaNoWriMo this year specifically, um, everybody who won NaNoWriMo gets a free paperbound copy of their book. It's a proof copy, which I don't really know what that means, but it's paperbound and you can, like, change the cover. Basically, it's going to be a paperback version of my novel. Um, I have the code, so I can get it free right now. It's just one free copy, shipping's free, everything. It'll be sent to my door, completely published for free. Just one copy, though. I wish I could get, like, seven or something, so I could send them all to you. But unfortunately, I can't. But that, I do have the code for it, so if I wanted to do it now, I would. Although, I kind of just hit 50,000 words and stopped, because I've been really busy lately, so I kind of want to finish it first. I'm not sure how long, how much longer finishing is going to take, word count wise, but um, yes. So, I will let you know when I decide to get that and when it comes in, because of course I'll show it off because it will be a paper bound version of my novel. Part 2 is kind of small and insignificant, but Madeline and I were talking about it today, and being that there's this huge cultural difference of how we express the date, which I wasn't really completely aware of. You know, I've spent my entire life putting the month first, so I had no idea that you guys put the day first, which I guess kind of makes sense. But anyways, we figured just to avoid any confusion, I would like to motion that we just stop putting the date on the top of our, on, on the title. Um, yeah, so if you would like to second this motion, you can either say so in the comments, or, you know, on your respective day, second the motion. If we uh, get someone to second the motion, then another person can then pass it, and we will no longer use dates. For now, I'm going to keep using the date, because I don't really put them up anyways, so, yes. You know, voice your opinion on that. If you don't want to second it, obviously don't second it, but if you do, second the motion, by all means. Third is the transition from YouTube into uh, widescreen. Uh, once again, I wasn't really aware of this either, because... When you're writing a novel, I, I didn't grant myself YouTube. I, I limited myself on my YouTube time simply because it was YouTube would have sabotaged me in my attempt to write a novel. So I watched your guys' videos. I made my video. I uploaded my videos. But otherwise, I just didn't watch much else. Much else. And then so when I like came on the site to watch a video and it was in widescreen, I was pretty surprised. I don't really know how to get mine. I right now I think I have black bars. I'm not even sure. I changed my camera setting so that it records in a bigger file, like in a bigger screen size. I don't know if that's going to fill the YouTube widescreen thing. I don't really have... Yeah. So I just made like a quick last second adjustment. So that's why I might be in less quality or maybe I'm bigger. I have no idea. If um if the black bars are there, I'd like to say hi to them to, you know, Alice and Jasper. I'm totally up for my black bars being named that too because it's like, you know the black bars of exotic tofu, but, um, yeah, so, if I'm in credit quality and if I don't look good in widescreen, I apologize, I probably didn't look any good in, um, 
Wh okay, what would it, what was the last one called then? If this is widescreen, is that small screen? This is a really stupid question. But like, what was the last one called? Which case, I probably did not look all that good in small screen. But um, you know, I'm gonna try and work on it eventually when I have time. And I'm you know done with my Secret Santa project, which is actually going very well. I'd love to show you it, but obviously that would spoil it. Then my friend Laura, she has this really cool gift, but hers is, you know, almost as involved in as my Secret Santa one. Although I will, I will show one Christmas gift. Although I won't say who it's from, just in case. Somebody this year is getting pink duct tape. That's all I'm gonna say. And with that, I'm done, and Henry wants to wish you a good week.